gonna talk about Sneeko real quick because this is why you don't have like twenty three year olds trying to talk about being a man on the internet. Like you, <laughs> this is why. This is why I go so hard on like the young kids because they have no idea what it's like to be a man on the internet. That's a fact. Um, so apparently, uh, this is brother on YouTube named Moist Critical. Moist, and Moist Critical. Oh, um, man. He has a couple. He has a couple channels. He's actually a really good dude. Um. And uh, I, I like some of his content. Some of his content is kind of funny. And he has like a, a like a, a melatonin, melatonin, mel- y'all know what I mean. Um, he just kind of talks in like a, a, a same vibration. He doesn't really change his speech pattern or anything. Mm. And um, uh, they were going back and forth. Everybody's talking shit about Sneeko being a cuck. So if you haven't seen the episode, I don't know if you've seen that episode, um, where he was with agent and uh low because this was imagine see, imagine seeing the girl you love like get fucked. get fucked. Her? yeah i do i love her. yeah i love her and answer, you allowed answer. the love of your life to get, to get fucked get... by another man. is that the and one where he the... said his, his girl got tossed up in yeah her? his girl got tossed up yeah and, I, and all that. I, I didn't so... see it but i'll always remember it. <laughs> <laughs> it's not uh, good, bro i gotta sing you that i gotta <laughs> sing it bro it's crazy um he talks about his girl getting tossed up and how the guy was like laying next to him and shit, oh. beating, the, beating the draws off his girl. Oh. He even talks about like how his girl, bro, he talked about like how his girl was like moaning. Like, so can she <laughs> enjoy it? Like what if she's enjoying it too much? That's the thing, like, like uh, it's like she's moaning pretty loud. I she hate was that story so much. <laughs> <laughs> Just a villain arc. Yes, definitely. That's a, a villain that's arc. a villain arc. Definitely a villain that's arc. a villain arc, bro. That's how um, so yeah, he told, and you know and that's the thing, bro. Before we even finish, bro, what you put on the internet, bro, like what you put on, you can't get mad at people because you put out stories on the internet, and people take those stories and run with them, bro. Yeah. So everything that I put, out, I'm, I'm totally fine with. I'm totally okay with. They're funny stories. Anybody can bring those stories up, and I'm a lot, probably gonna laugh at myself because. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, yeah it might have been embarrassing, but I have I have moved past it. That's a, that's a part of being grown too. It's like moving past certain stories that you share with people. You know, isn't that saying? kind of the story that put him on too? In a way, or was he already? Kind uh, of I mean, he on? was kind of already on. Right, he right. was he was like 13 years old, I think, when he started. He did like Call of Duty. Oh, he's been on for a minute. Oh, he's been on for a minute. Oh, and then okay. he was doing like, and then he switched to kind of like this thought provoking content on youtube so he used to do like street content mm. and like he used to interview homeless people regular people on the street and talk about thought-provoking things right so you know and that's kind of like oh my god that's kind of like the funniest part about this too is like you turn from like this thought-provoking um conscious in young kid mm-hmm. to this red pilled matrixed out yeah motherfucker dog like it's kind of crazy how he how he did a 360 on this content <laughs> Um, so it's it's just kind of crazy, like this Neanderthal that's on the internet now. I'm just literally still thinking about that story. Man. Yeah, bro, it's, bro. It's, it's it's a crazy story. Um, but back to <laughs> Moist Critical. Um, he, you know everybody's joking around with it, so you know he hit Moist Critical about his girlfriend. Now nothing's wrong with Moist Critical's girlfriend. She's like a regular ass like woman. Like mm. it's, she's not like, I mean she's not like. A nine or a ten, but she's not like ugly either. Like you yeah, know what I mean? She's, she's just a cute av- girl. Yeah, just an average young look, lo- lo- um, little lady. And um, you know, Moist Critical and them had go- had a back and forth, and of course he brought the cuck thing again, and then Abba and Preach brought up the cuck thing again. So of course, Sneeko is now in a rage. You get what I'm saying? Um, and uh, he goes on his stream and he shows some guns on his stream. Like he's showing guns, talking about some here's. Here's my clips. Here's my clips. Hey, I'm probably going to come down there and see you or whatever the case may be. Lame as hell. <laughs> like, you <laughs> you a lame dude. I'm going to call you a lame, bro. There's nothing manly about that, bro. If you can't take a couple shots at from people, bro, like, you lame as hell to me, you know? Mm. Um, so, of course, Moist Critical reacts to that, too. Wow. And Moist Critical, I don't know if that was an AR-15 he had in that um, video or not, but... Hey man, you got some clips. That brother yeah. got magazines. Yeah, I'm yeah. letting you know right now. Them gu- <laughs> them little guns you showing in that that little 22 you showing in that video. <laughs> got the heat on them. Hey bro, Moist Critical got that fire. <laughs> <laughs> Moist Critical showed us three different weapons. Really? Hey bro, hey bro, 
it, hey, that's gonna be that's not gonna be a gunfight. That's no. it's, it's gonna be straight murder, massacre. <laughs> yeah, man. So stop doing that, bro. And and here's the thing: I always tell people um, early on when I made my behind the man reacts. When I made that, like, there's there's YouTube space, and then there's real life. Mm-hmm. Some people do not play like that yeah. on the internet, bro. Like we can we can join on each other all yeah, day and yeah, make yeah. videos critiquing each other all day. Yeah. But when y'all start getting into these fights and trying to fight people and trying to hey bruh weaponry you yeah weaponry yeah oh you you okay you're gonna find out you're gonna fuck around and find out and i think i think uh moist i think he lives in uh florida so yeah you oh. just made a video threatening him and he and he's like i'm gonna come down to visit you mm-hmm. when he puts you six feet under that's your fault mm-hmm. okay because they got to stand your ground rule so you know mm-hmm. hey you you keep playing keep playing Mm. Keep playing. <laughs> well, so the boy had ARs and also a- hey, bro, AKs nigga. and choppers and all kinds. Hey of man, shit. he I ain't seen no chopper. He just pulled out that <laughs> he just pulled out that big ass goddamn hand cannon that he had. <laughs> he pulled out two hand cannons and a fucking AR fifteen. So that's all you need. Hey man, <laughs> hey he let he just let. I'm pretty sure like if you walking around with an AR fifteen too, like I'm pretty sure. That and it looked tactical too, like it looked like decked out, like Call of Duty decked mm, out. Yeah, like this nigga put perks on that. Gun. He got the perks on the shit. <laughs> yeah, he got so lasers. He and got yeah. He he don't put attachments extra on mags shit. and yeah. all that. Exactly, big dog. <laughs> he he dropping thirty grips and yeah. <laughs> no, shit, <I'm> <laughs> shit. yeah, you he ain't gonna miss. Yeah, <laughs> he not missing, dog. 